if we're doing a little bit of everything, all right, Mr. Andrews is going to share some stuff. Here's one of the things, though, all right? So we do a style called Shotokan Karate. Everyone say Shotokan. Say that. Shotokan. Shotokan. So does anyone know what the animal is for Shotokan? Does anybody know? No? What the symbol is? It's actually called a Shotokan tiger, all right? So it's actually a tiger, all right? So a lot of the things that we do in our karate style is a fast, explosive, and hard style, okay? So when we throw that front kick, it's like we are boom, snapping, okay? Just like if a tiger would strike its prey, right? Yes, sir? You guys understand? Yes, sir. All right, wake up, Blake, get up, buddy. All right, strong. So we're gonna go get in that horse stance. We're gonna snap today with those palm heel strikes, all right? We're gonna work these, and then Mr. Andrew in a little bit is gonna show a different way of doing it, all right? So, ready, and go! And go! Palm heel up there, Blake. And go! 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 Awesome, so now we hit with a palm, guys, because guess what? In a real situation, or even what an animal does, do they close their knuckles and hit with their fists? No, your knuckles are actually softer than, I mean, I'm sorry, yeah, softer, like more delicate. They're gonna break easier than if you hit with this palm right here, okay? All right, so focus on that. That's why a palm heel is a really good one for self-defense. Yes, sir? Give those thumbs up. All right, again, horse stance. Ready, go! 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 Remember, nine here, so it's like it's up here to the head right now, at the nose. And go! And go! Inside, inside, ready, go! 